So welcome on in everybody. Hope you guys are all enjoying your week. Uh, you are of course live with the Broshi family on the island. We're continuing our retro RPG spotlight series. Uh, continuing our Golden Sun um, uh, playthrough. Um, of course, once we finish with this one, we'll move on to Golden Sun, Lost Age, and Dark Dawn. Um, in that order, um, this is a legacy playthrough, so we're playing through all of them in their respective orders. Uh, to put a little hi uh, uh, to highlight uh, one of, well, at least what I think to be one of Nintendo's best RPGs to date. I think I can go to the cave first. I don't even think I need to go to the the town first. I think I could technically go to the cave first. I guess I will go to the town first just because I have the lucky coins and whatnot. Um, we can put inside the uh, the fountain. Oh, excuse me, the fountain of truth. Big yawn. Sorry about that. I actually got a lot of sleep last night. Even though I slept poorly, um, I felt like I slept on it a long. You know how the saying goes, I slept like a log? Yeah, well, I felt like I slept on it. And my neck was like killing me this morning. I felt like I was fine at the start of the day, and then as soon as I got to work, I felt like I had a, the largest crick in my neck. I was like, this is terrible. And it could just be uh, the effect of going to work that caused it, because you know, you know how, like you go to a place that you just don't want to be at right now. Your body starts rejecting it. Power Brit. I'm who to get it to. I gotta sell some stuff. I got a lot of stuff in my pocket. Uh, maximum HP, 238, 222. We'll give it to Ivan. And that's just because Ivan is just known to have crap for HP. I messed up their little, uh... Oh, look, found another metal. Oh, wait, I forgot. There's a Mars Jenny in here. Make him a brute. Then we do, uh, throw. Um, now give that back. Frost. So yeah, how's everybody's week been? I'd say my week is going pretty well. Still dealing with the insurance company from the guy who hit me, um, but my leg is fine. I can walk normally, and by normally I'm at my normal pace that I usually go at. Um, I still can't run all that well. I can run, I just can't do it, you know, all that well. My uh, left leg, the one that got uh, sprained, still tends to tense up a bit if I try to run too hard so I just have to be careful when I run but it's not that bad it's not bothering me anymore that at the very least oh I forgot you can't stay anywhere because everywhere is booked here so ooh so I think I end up going straight to the castle don't I Wasn't somebody supposed to give me like a piece of corn? Maybe I have the wrong game. Alright, uh, give me a second chat. I gotta blow my nose. Alright, so we have six lucky medals, uh, which means we have a chance to get six items. Uh, we're trying to hit the bullseye, so let's give it a shot. Watch us hit the crab in the back and ruin everything. Oh no, we made it. We got it. What's up, Max? Like? Allergies are pretty bad this fall. Yeah, I've been fine all day though, but 
Like right now? <laughs> Not so much. How you been, Max? Like, we missed you here. How you feeling? Welcome back to the island. How's life been treating you? I hope it's all. Been, I hope it's been treating you well. I'm gonna hit that turtle. I don't know how I dodged the turtle and the crab. I'll take it. Bullseye. So we got the scale armor, the earth shield. Can I get one of the weapons though? That's why I'm here. I'm here for the weapons, man. Give me the good stuff. Oh, I hit the crab. No. Oh, I hit the turtle. No. He ruined everything. You ruined everything. Well, at least I got the tiara for, uh, what's her name? What's her name? Mia. I can't remember her name. Alright, let's go. Dodge the crab. Oh, you hit the turtle. Oh, you hit the same turtle. Get out of the way. Uh, the ninja hook. Oh, wait, isn't that cursed? I think that's a cursed item, too. Ugh, I hate cursed items. They suck. Okay, bullseye. Right in the center. Tada, what's up, man? Oh, I got another earth shield. Ew. Okay, so I want to hit the second yellow ring. The one closest to the center. I think that'll give me a weapon, right? Oh, God. You can do it. Oh, it hit the center again. Doing good, but working a lot. Good work or bad work? Oh yeah, what's up Ryu? How you been? No, I don't want to do anything. I want to get out of there. Okay, so I got the Assassin's Blade. It is not a uh, cursed weapon. 214 to 227, so that's a 13 point raise. Uh, 192 to 208. That's what, 16 points? And then 143 to 169, that is 20, 23 points? No, 26 points. Yeah, 26 points. So we give it to Ivan. Um, in exchange, we'll take away one of the Earth Shields. You don't need it. Uh, and then I guess the Ninja Hood boost agility. He's already fast enough as it is. That's... 13 points to a, to defense. Um, I kind of feel like I should give it to her. As my healer, I feel like she should be the fastest one, so I'm just gonna give it to her. So then I guess that means he wears the TR. Oh, he can't actually wear the TR, huh? Defense delusions. Okay, we just sell the TR then. Oh man, my allergies are really killing me right now. So I'll be Um, I guess I need to give it to him. Mm, what did I get rid of? I can get rid of the bottle of Hermes for now. I can't remember. Am I able to sell that yet? Like, do I need that right now? Resist all elements. We'll give that to him. Doesn't, they don't do anything. You just use it to increase your HP. Not increase your HP, but you know, heal yourself. Alright, let's go to the store real quick and sell some stuff. There we go. I was wondering when we are going to find the place, the store that sells the waters of life. Uh, we're going to give the second one to... I still don't use no game tickets. Why do I just sell those? I'm just gonna sell them. I'm literally never gonna use them. The game tickets, that is. Well, I've never played Golden Sun. It's weird how this era of gaming is retro. It both feels correct and yet wrong at the same time. <laughs> True. There are, there are still people who believe that uh, 
uh, Game Boy Advance is still technically not retro. I, no, I think it is. I feel like it is at least. I feel like it's been long enough that you could consider this retro. But I, I'm, at the same time, I also can understand uh, people who feel like it's not exactly retro. Game Boy Advance has that weird feeling of feels retro, but at the same time does not feel retro. You can you consider DS retro? Weird. Tickets are good for getting undergarments that boost stats. Oh, too late! I sold them all. <laughs> Whoopsie! I was like, I could not remember what they're for. Oh, sell them. Ooh, I wonder if I can buy them back. You can rebuy, I think. Oh, okay, see, look. See? I'm glad I paid attention to chat. Otherwise, I would have been screwed. Wouldn't it have been hilarious if I left the, uh... The, bot, the menu, and then they're like, I'm sorry, we don't give it back now. No, no give back these. I have a lot of amazing memories playing my DS in college. Then I realize how long that's been. And I just go, oh. Oh, no. I still play my DS. Uh, my 3DS, that is. That's not, that's not retro, but I play my 3DS so that I'm able to play uh, Advance Wars Dual Strike. As well as uh, Mega Man Battle Network 6 uh, Double Team DS. Um, outside of that, the only other games I have for my 3DS are like the, uh, the Pokemon games and, uh, Fire Emblem games. Wait, I get two of them? Wait, did I sell his weapon? Oh, I sold his weapon. <laughs> I was like, wait, why is that here? Because oh, I sold it. Poor Ivan. Didn't even get a chance to use it. Um, you can only hold 30 tickets per person, right? Yep. Okay, so I guess I'm giving the other ticket to him. You should be able to use tickets here, Kobe. You got a friend? You got a friend a DS capture card for Christmas. Okay. See, I wish I could get a capture card. Unfortunately, I found out about capture cards too late. Uh, the company that was doing the capture cards for DS 3DS stop doing it um and so i missed out on the the opportunity of getting one so sad too because i have tons of ds 3ds games i want to stream i just can't find a capture card for it they're doing it again if you're talking about living really um do they have a website If you have a website for them, let me know and I'll give you uh, permission so that you can post. It's called 3DS Capture. Yeah. I gave you a uh, couple minutes, all right. Yeah, this is what I was talking about. Also, they're doing it again. I don't... Mm. I don't think I have a regular 3DS. Oh, they're sold out. Design for new 3DS XL, no ETA. It's done when it's done. Oh, 
okay. Also, these are for like the original DS boards. I think I have. I have a DS Lite. I think is what I have, not original DS, not the big one. I have the the Mario DS Lite. I believe is what it's called. It's like a smaller red one with the M on it. Okay, um, I'm gonna bookmark this page um, so that I can check back on this one f um, frequently to uh, keep an eye on it. I wonder if they're ever gonna be uh, able to do 3DS XL. You have three DS capture cards right now, since you got a, a few in case, one breaks down, and one for front. Okay. They're doing DS, but 3DS is being manufactured. Uh, DS is still available though, okay. I have, I think I have a DS. Um, that screen, I think I tried playing my DS. Like the original DS, not too long ago, and I think that screen was so small that I, uh, I think I might have blacked out for a second when I was trying to look at it. Alright, so where do I go to trade in? The tickets. Why are you even there, little guy, um, second guy? Oh, it's the castle. Hey, a capture card would mean you could stream your DS screen to a monitor. Yeah, that's why I want to get one for my 3DS. But of course, all I have is XLs. I don't have the, the base 3DS anymore. I, I believe my wife had one, but she gave it to her brother. Um, and that's just because we all had the XL. So I'm praying that they decide to do a capture card insert for uh, XL. Because uh, that would come in handy. Okay, let's uh, go up here and see if I can spin this to heck. Is there somebody sitting on ether? Alright, so I, I guess I can't spin the tickets. Maybe it's one of those wait until after the tournament's over to spin. Latest on 3DS boards from Luffy's form is that there'll be a small supply come November. Okay, so I'll keep an eye on it for uh, November. See if I can get one uh, purchase. Hopefully I can get one uh, set up with some of the money I get back from, or that I should be getting back from this pain and suffering uh, from this car accident last week. All right, so it should be a slot machine, if you remember correctly, inside the town. A slot machine in Tolby. I saw the lucky dice table. Uh, I didn't see a slot machine. I have to go back. There was a Mercury Genie over here. All right, chat. Um, there's about to be an ad starting in about uh, a minute. Um, at that time, it'll run for about a minute and a half. Um, and while that's running, I'm gonna run and grab my, uh, my allergy medicine and whatnot. Wow, did I, I think I just one-shot the, uh, the Jitty. I forgot the Jitty was here, by the way. Oh, sorry about, uh, the car accident. I had to sit on jury duty for pain and suffering car accident case. Yeah. I was, uh, I got into the accident last Wednesday when somebody T-boned my, uh, driver's side. Alright, ad starting in five, four, three, two, one. I will be right back while the ad's playing. Uh, let me go get my allergy medicine because I, otherwise I'm not going to be able to do this stream thing. I can take a look at it now then. 
Oh, I guess I should save just in case since I just did the thingy. Can't confirm ad stop sweet. I got back just in time. Um, also, I should apologize to everybody in chat, to all my non-subs. Um, it's something that I'm trying out to stop pre-roll ads on the channel. Um, so, the way it works is every, I want to say every 30 or so minutes, uh, my channel will run a minute and a half ad. Um, and what this does is, uh, it stops all pre-roll ads from running. So for anybody that's coming into the channel for the first, you know, for the day, uh, they won't have to worry about getting bogged down with like a two minute or more ad uh, when they enter the channel. Cause I don't know about you all, but when I enter a channel that, and it throws an ad right at my face, if I'm not busy doing something, I will more than likely just leave the channel. Um, and go for and go to like one of my subscribed uh, channels so that I don't have to worry about ads Because I, I I like watching content. I hate watching ads Okay, so I'm gonna use four tickets Um, so do I stop it somewhere? Oh, so it won't spin those particular ones? Well, let's see, what, what am I looking at here? Shirt, 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 shirt. And I think that's fine, right? I got one more shirt. Come on, give me the other shirt. Maybe I should go for the stars. Those stars are in the wrong spot though. I'm trying to get the shirts lined up right there. Interesting, so that's how that worked. There's a lot of chances that you fall that you quit going to because of ads, yeah. So, this way, you'll get an ad in the channel. Uh, during that time that the ad is running, I won't play any games. I'll still talk, but I won't play any, do any gameplay things. Um, and then when the ad stops, and people can confirm that the ad has stopped, I'll continue or resume the gameplay. Um... Give me a second because my monitor's doing this weird thing where it's like making this weird glitch noise. I like it. There it goes. Alright, let's try that again. I'm just gonna do one ticket. Okay, so. Does anybody in chat know what the hearts do? I honestly, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I've never used the slot machines in this game ever before. Is it better to line up the hearts, the shirt, or the moon? My guess is the shirt's gonna give me some kind of chest armor piece. But I, I have no idea what the heart's gonna do. Get the shirt? Alright. Ah, we got two moons and a, a ring. We got a star, a boot, and a moon. You don't know what heart does anymore? I wonder if the star means anything. When you get five hearts in a row, you get a game over because it counts as a heart attack. <laughs> that actually would be kind of funny to see happen. I'm not gonna lie, that actually would kind of be kind of hilarious to see. I was short one shirt, by the way. Okay, so we have to do moons, right? I got another boot and another shirt.
So I get a ring? You want a war ring. So do the moons act like bars or something like that? Use to boost attack. Well, I'm selling that. I can just use Ivan to boost attack. I don't need a ring to boost attack. What's going on with you guys? It's amazing fireworks effect. I know, right? I just wish they gave me something better to use with it. Uh, you know what? Let's see what the heart does. I feel like I should have kept that star. This is the last spin, right? Too bad. I'm only spinning one ticket at a time now. Go for shirts and boots. Well, now we have moons. Stop giving me the ring with the moons! Is it always the ring with the moon? Uh, used to restore 7 PP. Really? It's all you get is 7 PP? What the heck is wrong with these bad rings? What? Square fireworks with fate. <laughs> Those are the best kind of fireworks, man. You know that. Alright, let's do shirt and moon. Give me one more shirt or another moon. You need a blue pill if you if you want even bigger PP. Oh well, we got three boots, so lock those in. Oh, got another boot. Now we just need one more boot. Let's go. Okay, so they're not really square. They're more like circles, right? They're like little circles. Fur boots. Oh my god. That sounds absolutely atrocious, actually. Uh, boost defense and resist water. Oh, well, you know... Well, you kind of have to give those to Garrett, right? I mean, he's the... The fire guy, so you give him the fire, the water resisting boots. So he doesn't die. The individual embers are square. They look like uh, circles to me. time this game hates me this is why I don't gamble chat this is why I rarely gamble I kind of want to keep the star for see what it does one moon and four shirts let's go we got a shirt chat Gamble three times in your whole life and never with your own money. Well, I mean, that's the best way to gamble. If you're gambling with your own money, then something's clearly wrong. Right? I am so glad that you told me this was here, uh, Ryu. I had absolutely no idea this existed. I guess I should say I have a very vague memory of this being here. I'm gonna try a star. I'm gonna try a shirt and star. Stop with the stupid heart. Okay, so the star doesn't do anything. 
it was for your birthday and other special events. If I just gave you 50 bucks and told you to make it last, you made it last, walked away with the vast majority of it. Well, there you go. I've only gambled once in my life, and that was at, uh, in Vegas. You know, you're in Vegas, so you kind of just do stuff. Because it's Vegas. Alright, I need one heart. Oh, I got a boot. But, uh, I actually did well in the Vegas gambling. Okay, I'm actually going to take the stars over the heart. Or so I thought. It's really hard to get the stars, huh? Uh, shirts. Alright, another shirt. Well, we got a shirt, chat. We got a running shirt this time. Last time was a silk shirt. This time it's a running shirt. Let me guess. Boost agility? Yep. I can make Garrett faster. And you know what's sad? He's still slower than everybody. <laughs> Restore, oh, okay. So, do, what does the star do, do you know? What does the star do? I, I believe it's a valley. believe it's a valley, but what if it wasn't a valley? Moon boot, moon boot, moon. I got the hyper boots. Boost defense and critical hits. Uh, five to defense, two to defense, um, three, five to defense, five to defense. Okay, so everybody gets five, essentially, except for Garrett. Garrett gets two. I guess I just let him keep it, right? Uh, let me give this ticket to Garrett. I'll just hold on to it. What if Stardew, uh, Stardew wasn't a valley, then it'd be a sequel. <laughs> Start was water of life and elixir. Heart is just nuts and such. Oh, okay, star is the heart, uh, water of life and elixir, okay. So don't do heart, gotcha. So everything but heart. And the moon acts as a wild card, essentially. to lock that boot. I missed my chance to get the boots because I missed, I spun one. Well, that was luck. Now we get a mithril shirt. This one's going to be defense and uh, water resistance. Watch. Oh, it's defense and HP. Uh, well, geez. I feel like Ivan needs this shirt because he has absolutely no HP. That sounds like the perfect Ivan shirt. Nope. 
Now he has almost as much HP as Mia. So now he's that... Completely solved. A shirt made of Metro sounds itchy? It probably is. Um, I got a moon and two shirts. Two moons and two shirts. Got the star! Let's go. Got a side crystal. You know what? I'll take that. Um, I can only have five empty spaces left. I need to keep that in mind. I only have five empty spaces left. So I can only win five more non, uh, space items in me. It's like the antique oven mitts you can find, uh, that are made of, uh, asbestos. Was it asbestos? Sure, it'll protect you from heat and even most open flames, which you're getting long term. Isn't asbestos, like, bad for you, though? I got a heart. I got a boot sandwich make, uh, with the heart as the the bread. Think of like crescent rolls, but with boots. It's bad if you enjoy being healthy and, uh, and breathing. Hey, I got more fur boots because yes. Who did? Who doesn't need fur boots? I mean, she already resists water, right? I give them to him. He can use some boots. I'm just curious to see how many types of boots they have here. Looks like we need a shirt this time, though. They gave me one more shirt at the end, but the other one was a boot. Well, you kind of have to grab this, right? Now, I just need a moon or a shirt. Come on, game. Lame. How could they do this to me? Hyper boots are usually what you grab. I would love more hyper boots. I kind of feel like I need to do this, right? The gamble paid off. Got an elixir? Oh wait, elixir suck. I forgot about that. Elixirs are absolutely doo doo. All I can do is sell those. I love how they, in most games, elixirs are like the most impressive uh, medicine you can get. But in this game, elixirs are just doo doo. It's an item you can do without. Come on, you need more boots. Okay, I need the boot. Give me a boot. There we go. All right, let's see if we can get some more hyper boots. Yay! We got another hyper boot. We got another hyper boot. We got another hyper boot. Hyper boot. Hyper boot. Hyper boot. Hyper boot. Um, I have two spots open. So I think I want two more hyper boots. Oh, they gave me the shirts. Wow, they refused to give me the last moon or shirt.
Unfortunate. I think my luck has run out, chat. Alright, got another shirt. Got another, ooh, another agility shirt. I wonder who I give that to, though. I mean, I can give it to Ivan. I mean, I, not Ivan, Isaac. Not that he needs to go any faster than he already goes. But sure, why not, right? At least you have luck. I have the antithesis of luck. Uh, it isn't bad luck since you can't even have <laughs> It's just chaos. That's unfortunate. You, sir, need a goddess on your side. That's what it is. You need a goddess. One that will turn your bad luck into good luck. Decided to embrace chaos and worship it as your guy. <laughs> I mean, so long as it makes you happy, then I'm happy, okay? Now, just don't go destroying any worlds, okay? I think I have one more ticket left, right? Kind of feel like stars the way to go this one. Should win boot. No more game tickets. Destroying worlds is what makes you happy. Yeah, but I don't know how I feel about dying. I mean, I'm glad it makes you happy and all, but, uh, preferably without, you know, destroying the world, if at all possible. Oh, I gotta go sell stuff because I have full pockets, and if I'm going to this dungeon with full pockets, it's a terrible idea. Okay, so we want to sell... Nothing from you. Nothing from you. Oh, for you, we want to sell that ring. From you, we want to sell the boot, the elixir, and the ring. I wonder if I should just sell these herbs. I don't think I'm ever going to use them again. But if we don't destroy the world, but destroy other things with the world, so it's the earth crashing to asteroids rather than the other way. I mean, no, because then the world still be destroyed. The world would be destroyed as a result of it destroying other things. And that sounds equally as bad. No, the Earth remains. The asteroid just playing God afterwards. But wouldn't the Earth get destroyed from the impact? Like in this one of the situations where, regardless of the impact. Or who caused the impact? Wouldn't both items still be, you know, decimated? Also, what even is this conversation we're having?
It's getting dark. It's getting dark in here. Oh wait, these are the gargoyles, man. These gargoyles are some duty. Uh, oh, I got flash storm. Didn't even realize it. Actually, let me use one of these crystal powers. Now let's use an oil drop. Oil drop into flare storm. Yeah, into flare storm. You know what? Let's go with the storm ray too. And you know why not just do an ice storm while we're at it? Life on Earth might be affected, but the Earth itself would be fine. You know what I heard? I heard. Oh, you'll be dead, but the Earth will be perfectly safe. <laughs> um, how do I do this? Do I crystal powder them? So the rotten blood actually does damage. Um, Storm Ray. Ooh, that's some some serious damage right there. Wait, Isaac's faster than Ivan now? That's new. It's always usually Ivan, Isaac, Mia, then Garrett, but now it's Mia, Isaac, Ivan. Then Gary. Fake? Yep, fake. Life on Earth is just a rounding error when it comes to the planetary mass.